The dollar is also doing well. The U.S. is doing well. Just recently, I said this with a lot of respect and humility, in all humility. Because I'm the external affairs director, I happen to travel around Europe. I was in Germany, I was at in the UK. At your expense. And, no, at your expense. Please, it's the parties. Don't do that. I don't like this. And you could tell <laughs> that Germany, they are suffering. Like, they are really suffering. UK is where I took um, Uber from the airport to the hotel I went to lodge. And the driver was talking about how a year he was spending 850 on gas, but now he's spending 2,500 pounds on gas. So things are increasing everywhere. I am not saying that we should use that as an excuse, but we live in a competitive market where the, 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 the performance of another country has a huge effect on another country. I am saying that the dollar is performing well. We have short supply of dollars in the system. We must admit. So government is meeting the stakeholders to ensure that at the end of the day... And you're saying something meet? positive will come. Exactly. Something okay. I you, am you, you've lived in the U.S. Before I come to it, I mean, to, let's be sincere. When you first came around to make sure you joined government in Ghana, I saw you. Yeah. Would you realistically side with that um, comparison we keep making with the U.S. economy and the Ghana economy? You can never, ever in your life compare Thank you for the that U.S. 